And there's also another hockey team here in the Bay Area that's making a name for itself. ABC Action News sports anchor Kyle Berger introducing us to the best college team you may not even know about. This is definitely the best start in uh, UT hockey's history. The University of Tampa hockey team is off to a 16-1-1 start and ranked number one out of 153 teams in the CHF, the Collegiate Hockey Federation's national rankings. We've had some good starts but uh, nothing that continued all the way through the first semester. UT is a Division II school that has about 10,000 students, but they still compete against the traditional Division I powerhouses. It's actually crazy, like, going up and playing, like, University of Buffalo and Buffalo State. Like, we went up there for a tournament kind of deal. It, it was fun. It's crazy because, like, we're, we are so small and we go into these big schools, but I think it just gives us an advantage. You know, we have nothing to lose. I think something that's extremely different from other teams that I've been on is we got four four lines that are all scoring. I mean, that's something that is really unheard of. The roster is made up of mostly student athletes from way up north with a pair of Tampa Bay kids sprinkled in. Coming from Minnesota and already playing on kind of a gritty up north team, um, we have a lot of skill level. We have a lot of guys that are fast, good hands, speed, can shoot. The Spartans have 16 wins so far this season. That means 16 times they've continued their locker room tradition of a freestyle victory rap. It's like we got a big speaker in here, right? 110 South Eddie, you know that's the spot. So everyone kind of gets excited, thinks they can rap whether they can or can't. I love country music, so the song is good to me, but it's just like he talks about everyone on the team. We like made it together. An unbreakable bond on and off the ice. In Clearwater, Kyle Berger, ABC Action News. Sorry.